guys, so right now I am at um, Echizen city of Fukui prefecture and I'm here to explore with NHK awesome people this place because there's actually so much more to this place than you know just um, I don't know, I don't know much about this place to be honest so today will be a good day for me to learn about this place <laughs> Don't touch, don't touch, don't touch. I'm very spicy, the, the, the way. Yes! So right now I'm here at Kura no Tsuji, which is like a place where there are like lots of um, like Japanese traditional style buildings and these buildings are like not so much for people to live in they're like warehouses and um, like traditional Japanese houses they're made of like just wood um, so it's you know not so strong but these there are of um, stronger material and um, they can withstand um, like moisture and uh, all sorts of harsh weather and stuff so it's good for like storing important um, things Oh look, this is my awesome mic that they gave me to film. Yeah, it kind of suits my outfit, but anyways, yes! So we're at um, Kuran Chiji. Um, that's about it for here, but um, yeah, hopefully there'll be more cool stuff to come. I'll be like doing lots of different things later, so I'm very excited. So right now I'm at a Tanzu shop, which is like, you know, all these drawers here. Tansu is like these drawers and what's so special about these drawers is the fact that they are made purely um, by just wood. So it's like they put holes in the wood and then they kind of like put it together like a puzzle. Like you see these like they're actually like put in like what measured out and then you know drilled out, sanded down to perfection so that every piece of the wood would fit in its place. It's very accurate, like, oh my goodness, very detailed. Look at that. Like, oh my goodness. No nails, no screws, no nothing. You see over here, like, that bit of roof is actually thicker and stronger than that bit of roof up there. The reason for that is um, because in the olden times they would make the drawers on the second floor and they would throw the um, materials from the ground up to the second floor therefore the roof of the second floor has to be strong enough to withstand you know the weight of the materials being thrown up yeah pretty cool they're filming over there some close-ups and stuff cool right yeah oh my god look at the camera <laughs> So instead of ha having the hagane material as a whole knife, they have it between two other pieces of metal and to get the knife to actually cut, they have to sand the outer metal to get the inner metal called hagane. So it's very interesting, there's a lot of process, there's the um, beating process and then the sanding process and there's a lot of sanding process to get to the um, the, the point where you can actually use the knife so it's very interesting and I'm gonna be doing my own soon they're trying to work things out but I can't wait yes so then we start okay 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 okay
、もう持つほう。茶碗を持つんですかね。はい。あ、あの<笑>フォークを持つほう。フォークもあと。はい。はい。オッケー。でこれが材料です。材料。おお、ピカピカ。さっきはあの鉄の。金属を叩いてたと思うんですけど、うん、今銅板でこのペーパーナイフ作ってもらいます。はい。はい。じゃあやりましょう。よし。はい。こちらです。わあ、何これ。なんで銅なんですか。えっと、加工しやすいように、うん。鉄だと結構時間がかかるので。そうですね。銅板だと加工もしやすい。はい。削りやすい。じゃあ、こちらです。こちら。はい、まずこう、ま。同じようにします。で、ぐんってはめている。え、うまいんちゃう、私は。いいですね。いいですね。<笑>はいはい。丸も。はい。はい。オッケーです。これでいいですか。はい。はい。じゃあこの通りだいたい切りますんでだいたい切ります、はい、よしよしあと少し硬いですね大丈夫ですか<笑>コツはどうですかコツはどういうこと押すときに力を入れてくる押すときに力うんグッとうん違う違うこっちこっちへねグッグッあっうんこれどうがなすりでこの滑らかになるんだよねそうですねちょっと粗めのペーパーやすりなんですけどオッケーどうしよう、ちょっとピ,ピーになってますね<笑><笑>下が出てないですねペイチェルになってしまう<笑>もう一回やるでカチャッと同じところへあ,あ今ピーチェルになりピーチェルになりしっかりうん、うん、あ、生きた素晴らしい,素晴らしい完成。完成でーす。ありがとうございます。ペンナイはい。Uh, manufacturing comes from this area, so this is the shrine that protects and watches over、um, all the paper making in this city. May, around May, there is like、um, a paper festival, and like the goddess would come down from the main shrine to visit all the people and stuff like that. So that's pretty cool.、Um, I was just praying over there a sec ago for the main. Um, filming, so. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, everybody. So, right now I'm here at a soba、um, restaurant, and this is the Echi Zen、um, style soba, the Oroshi soba. And as you can see, the soba itself is actually thicker than usual, the normal soba. It's maybe, I'd say, three times thicker. So,、um, I tasted it before for the Filming and it's actually very, very chewy. It's like,、um, 
like a bit like udon and soba but not really so yeah it's very i'm very spicy the the, the daikon orochi is very very spicy and um apparently this is what um soba is um to the people in fukui ken <laughs> うちのうちのっていうかうちのカメラさんですカメラマンさんですでさっき紹介したあのエッチゼンあのそば食べていただきたいと思いますよしユーチューブにあるんだよよし三二一うわめっちゃ進んでるどうですか<笑><笑> <よし。笑> 美味しい。え、なんかめっちゃ辛い。辛いっていう顔してた。ほんまにほんまほんま。そうなん。よ、レイチェルめっちゃ辛かったよ。辛くないよ、これ全然。辛くないですよね。辛いよ。でもうどん
little bit of air, but that's normal. Usually we have air. Let's see. Now, this is the one that I have to do. I'm going to go to the one that I have to do. I'm going to go to the one that I have to do. I'm going to go to the one that I have to do. I'm going to go to the one that I have to do. I'm going to go to the one that I have to do. 小さいからみんなに愛してもらえる番犬にはちと向かないかもしれないけど泥棒さえきっと僕にメロメロだろうあんあ切ない風にあったあってもあんあ散歩はしてるさてみんなに挨拶だおみくじ買いに行きたいと思いますマネキネコマネキネコマネキネコおみくじ二百円二百円入れまーすよしよしよしよしよしこれやんなよしおなんか入ってるマネキネコやんはいじゃあこれはまあ別にしてえっと一番読めたいところ読みます。愛情<笑>退屈な関係と言って新しい無理な動きは禁物縁談も平凡な形でまとまる養子縁組は基地えいいこと普通,普通えイオとか見つけれる普通え見つ,かれ見つけれへんっていう意味え努力すれば報われるけどほんまにえいやいやえ悲しいちえ So we finally finished filming. It's been a long three days.、Um, I learned a lot of things from this experience, like、um, about Japan, Japanese culture, about filming, about reporting. So it's been a really good experience. I met lots of nice people. Ta da! Yay! That's Raquel there in the middle. Um, the guy Shibata, he's the announcer, and then the director Narita, Miss Narita. So, yes, and hardworking cameraman filming over there, and lazy cameraman packing up already. No, just kidding, but yes,、um, yeah, guys, seriously, like Japan's not just you know shopping and eating and you know doing all the things you usually see on TV,、um, there's so much more like. Coming to Fukui Prefecture, you know, I learned, I felt the Japanese spirit like、um, making things from scratch and keeping tradition true, traditions true. So, yeah, it was very nice to see and experience some of the, you know,、um, making of the washi and knives firsthand. So, yeah, very appreciated for this experience. So, you guys definitely come and Check Fukui out too. Alright, that's it for this video. Subscribe to my channel and I hope to see you in my next video. Oh, and follow my Twitter and Facebook and Instagram and Snapchat, even though I don't use Snapchat, but yes.、Um, yes. <laughs>